one. Justin Whittle runs in the second spot. Challenge low by the 1A of Jacob Allen. Allen not quite able to make the move. Behind Allen, it's the 41 of Carson Macedo. Macedo tried to hold the inside lane in three and four, couldn't make it work. Three wide behind them. A war for the final transfer spot. Coming in, and Austin Bishop, Lucas Wolf, Brian Brown, and Sheldon Hottenshield. Nearly three wide again out of turn number two. Lucas Wolf comes away with the transfer position. Right behind him, Austin Bishop. Brian Brown trying to make it work on the high side of the speedway out of turn number four. Brown around the outside of Bishop. Now Brian Brown up into the sixth spot. Needs to pass one more car to qualify for the feature. Trouble in the turn number one car into the wall, the 17 of Sheldon Hot and Shield. Heat race number three. We'll also track Sheldon Hot and Shield's progress from the rear of the field in the NOS Energy Drink number 17. Lance DeWeese, the race leader, into turns three and four. Justin Whittle stays with him. DeWeese now accelerates, and the green flag waves once again. Brian Brown on the outside of the speedway. Sheldon Hodge by three cars coming out of turn number four. Sheldon already back in that battle for the final transfer spot. Brian Brown trying to get a spot away from Lucas Wolf and goes to the outside of the speedway again in three and four. Jacob Allen part of that mix as well. Carson Macedo has taken third. Jacob Allen running fourth, Brian Brown in the final transfer spot now. Brown looking for a run up top. Sheldon Hodgshill trying to track down Wolf and Brown from the rear of the field. Lance DeWee still showing the way. Justin Whittle right behind him in the second spot. Brian Brown again to the high side in turn one, coming after the shark racing 1A of Jacob Allen, nearly gets into the wall on a turn two, and that allows Lucas Wolf to close in the 5W. Now Wolf to the inside of the speedway in three and four. Lucas Wolf can't get that fourth spot away from Brian Brown, but he is right on Blackjack's back bumper. Now makes the move to the inside, entering turn one. Brian Brown got up in the slick stuff there, and now Sheldon Hottenshield closing on Brian Brown for the final transfer spot. Hottenshield to the inside of the Speedway in three and four. Not enough room to make it work there. Sheldon from the rear of the field after contact with the wall earlier on in this one. Sheldon Hodgson works low in one and two. Brian Brown has built momentum on the high side of the speedway. Time is running out for the NOS Energy Drink 17. Leader Lance DeWeese looks at the white flag. One lap remaining. Sheldon Hodgson, another run on Brian Brown down the front stretch into turn one. Sheldon will work the top as Brian Brown goes low. Sheldon Hodgson with one last run down the back straightaway. Checker flag will wait for Lance DeWeese. We'll watch Sheldon Hodgson and Brian Brown for the transfer spot. Out of turn number four for the final time. Brian Brown hangs on. Sheldon Hodgson with a valiant effort. Finishing order looks like this. Lance DeWeese, the winner in the 69K. Justin Whittle, second in the 67. Third, the 41 of Carson Macedo. Fourth, the 1A of Jacob Allen. Fifth, the 5W of Lucas Wolf. Those five drivers qualify for the feature. Sixth, to the 21 of Brian Brown. Seventh, the 17 of Sheldon Hodgshield. Eighth, the 35 of Austin Bishop. Ninth, the 39 of Cameron Smith. And in 10th, the 11K of Craig Kinzer. Lucas Wolf will make his way to the interview area on the inside of corner number three. Wolf with that final transfer spot in car number five W. And so locking into the feature, Lucas Wolf in the five W. He's downstairs to talk to Chase Rodman. 2015 Port Royal Speedway track champion with 12 victories to his credit here at this racetrack. Got the helmet off down here. Man, Lucas, the starts here at Port Royal Speedway just seem absolutely hectic. And uh, that seems like where you could either make up a couple spots or lose a couple spots. Luckily for you, you're able to hang on and grab the transfer spot. Yeah, yeah, it's brutal, especially when you're in the, uh, the tr you know, the transfer or either making it or not. Uh, it puts you in a bad spot. A lot of times kind of the row in front of you can, uh, can dictate more what happens to you than not. But I was good enough to... Uh, to overcome some some things that kind of didn't go my way so so far so good just uh, see how we do all right lucas wolf gonna transfer out of heat race number three best career finish here with the outlaws was a third back in 2004. Thanks, Chase.